Hi and welcome to the section of the unit conversion tutor and now we're finally going to start getting into some real unit conversions okay and first we're going to start tackling the concept of units of length okay let me uh, let me say a few words up ahead of time here first of all I'm very excited to actually teach you this because I know what it's like to be sitting and doing your homework trying to convert units and not knowing if you should multiply or divide and oh my goodness I can't find a conversion factor for this so how, how do I do it and, and just not knowing it, how to check your work and all these things and it's very confusing when you first start learning how to do this okay you've got to master this it's gonna make your life so easy I learned I don't even want to call it a trick because it's not even a trick but it's it's the proper way to do this stuff not all books teach it most books don't teach it and certainly not most teachers teach it I was very fortunate to have a teacher that showed me this a long time ago years ago and I still use it almost every single day certainly if I'm learning any kind of new math material I use what I'm going to show you here almost every day so it's very very important very powerful if you master this you're going to go through physics and chemistry with a breeze because everyone else is going to be trying to figure out how to convert the grams to, to whatever else you're trying to do with your complicated units and you're just going to understand how to do it because it's very very powerful okay now the other thing I'll say is I've split the rest of this DVD into length and um, time and area and volume and speed and all these different things okay uh, how do I say this don't become under the illusion that there's gonna be everything anything different between this section and the next section I mean yeah in this section I'm gonna talk about length and the next one I'm gonna talk about area and then volume but the technique is what I'm trying to teach you I'm not making this DVD so if you have to convert length you come watch the section and convert length I'm, t I'm teaching this DVD because I want you to understand the technique the technique can be applied to anything. It's kind of like learning how to read, okay? There's a whole lot of overhead in learning how to read, right? How to sound the letters out, how to make sentences and all that. But the point of learning how to read isn't so that you can just sort of read one, one story that you're trying to learn in, in first grade. It's because when you learn how to read, you can pick up any book and learn it, okay? Same thing here. I'm not teaching you length and volume and area and so on just so you can do that. I'm teaching you because these techniques, which is really only one technique by the way, can be used for anything. And that's why in this DVD I don't have sections devoted to chemistry conversion of units or physics unit conversion or um, nursing uh, you know, dosage calculations because those are all different applications but the technique is exactly the same. So if you understand what I'm trying to show you here, you can apply this to any problem you have no matter what the units, even if you make up your own units, if you have a unit that you made up that makes sense, you can use this technique for that. So all the, um, the fireworks are out in the front here and you're probably wondering what this technique is. Let's, let's show you. Before we actually get to that part, let's write a few things down. I'm going to show you the English units and I'm going to 